Well, today mostly gloomy, but tomorrow should pack a lot of sunshine. Robert Sir joining us now with a look ahead towards the big day Thanksgiving, of course, but leading up to that as well. And, you know, we talked about that clearing that you showed that perfect line it hit right around sunset in some parts of the area. Yeah, pretty much on time with, with what we thought, just enough to give us a taste of sunshine of what we're going to see tomorrow, which will be abundant sunshine. Lovely sun splash skies out there. Nice and quiet out there this evening. There's a live look outside to Fort Smith right now where things are nice and quiet. Not too bad in Fort Smith, 63 today, two degrees above your average, which is 61 for November the 21st. Bitterly cold morning in 1964, 19. That is a chilly morning. Nice and pretty in Fayetteville, the Fayetteville squares we just showed you there. We're also above average, slightly in Fayetteville. You got up to 61 for a brief period before that front blasted through. We should be at 57. Uh, for this time of the year. Temperatures right now continuing to cool off 37 at Drake Field, but 45 in Bella Vista and Rogers, 49 uh, in uh, the Paris area near Mount Magazine and 50 in Clarksville. All of these numbers are cooler, surprisingly, or not surprisingly, than they were at this point yesterday after that front came through. 20 degrees cooler right now in Fayetteville, double digits uh, below yesterday in Ozark, Boonville, Grove as well. Cooling off and will be a little bit cooler tomorrow as the uh, northward flow around this area of high pressure continues to push cooler air into our area. There's that clearing line continuing to sag to the south. Tomorrow morning waking up, you can see uh, right around the freezing mark for northwest Arkansas, upper 30s for the uh, River Valley. High will move off to the east, not a bad day tomorrow and Tuesday. Notice no clouds here. It really won't be until the second half of Wednesday. That's when we're going to start to see clouds ahead of this cold front that's going to bring us some rain showers Wednesday night and into Thursday. And this front could cause some travel delays if you are heading out of town for the holiday. Anywhere you see that yellow, there could be some travel delays. And then on Thursday, some people do travel on Thanksgiving. The worst of it looks to be in the Ohio River Valley and then the Gulf Coast of Texas where they could see some very, very heavy rainfall. Lows tonight will mostly be in the lower to mid 30s out there and then tomorrow rebounding back up on average into the mid 50s. Lots of sunshine uh, for the extended period, especially Monday, Tuesday, and then Wednesday and Thursday. We watch for those rain showers to move in here. I think most of Wednesday is dry and most of Thursday is dry. It's Wednesday evening through Thursday morning. Uh, that is when we're watching for those showers. Early, or early this week in the River Valley, also nice. Mid 60s Tuesday and Wednesday. A chilly Thanksgiving, though, but most of us are inside enjoying the holiday. And then if you are headed out early Friday morning, Paul, for some of those Black Friday deals, uh, we'll be at the freezing mark, most likely in the River Valley and a few degrees below freezing in northwest Arkansas. So grab that jacket. Yeah, bundle up if you're heading out for Black Friday.